So it was the worst in filming. Let's see. So that's how it looks right now. I just cleaned up the kitchen a little bit. It doesn't look like anything. I really don't like this kind of kitchen, but I'm definitely gonna do something with the tiles and so on and something over here. This lamp is just there because nothing arrived yet. I just took a few things with me. Um, so this is the bathroom. Wait for it. Uh, this is gonna be fixed in, I don't know, in a few days, hopefully. I put down a rug and I cleaned up the whole thing. I have like really a thing, like if somebody used bathrooms and kitchens before, I really don't like that. So I scrub it all away. Uh, any germ that was in here did not survive. And other than that, everything is really, really empty. So I don't have anything to show. So this is my bed for now. These are my fancy socks that, yeah, this is my bed. I'm, I was supposed to get my bed frame today. I didn't, I have to paint this. Whoever lived here before thought that was a great idea, especially like painting it like so far into the corner, not even like in the middle or something, maybe because of this little guy, but I think it's ridiculous, whatever. What ifs? <laughs> I'm gonna paint this and I'm right now sleeping on on this mattress. But basically my view is all over like that. I don't wanna show like the whole street and anything because um, that would go too far sharing where I live. Uh, I've got a few boxes here. Um, there's like a little cabinet over here. This is the second bedroom or and office. Um, yeah, this, I mean, it looks, it looks a little bit prison-y. <laughs> but yeah, I'm definitely working on it. I yeah, just moved in today. I'm super, super tired. I'm so sorry I didn't film more. But um, yeah, you did not miss out on anything. There's uh, like nothing, nothing really exciting happened. So um, as soon as my um, furniture arrives, I'm gonna show you how I'm like, gonna decorate everything as far as as I can because um, I'm gonna do it like step by step. I'm not gonna buy everything at once. Uh, that's not realistic at all, money-wise. So, um, yeah, today I I'm just like gonna go sleep, that's it. Like there's nothing, nothing else left to do and I'm super, super tired, but Tomorrow, I'm definitely gonna take you along to a coffee shop or just like relaxing a little bit. Um, the guy who's fixing my internet is gonna come today, uh, tomorrow. All right. <laughs> um, and gonna, um, I'll have to like, you know, make a, a few, run a few errands. Um, I'm gonna try to take you along as far um, as it is like it has to be interesting you know like I don't want to just like take you randomly along and on the other hand I really have to study I still have to do my flashcards I'm so behind I have only one and a half weeks left to study I'm so gonna not pass i feel like so um yeah let's see and on monday i um have my talk with one of my profs um because i'm writing a, um, a 15 page essay kind of thing that i have to turn in and um i have to i like i 
offered him kind of 10 different topics and now he said just choose one and uh, let's talk about it and now over the weekend I will have to choose one of the topics that I suggested and um, I really don't know which one it will be yet so it's gotta take care of that as well um, yeah um, gonna go have a good night's sleep I'll see you tomorrow thank you so much mm -hmm.
sind unter Umständen recht unverständlich, setzen viel Vorwissen voraus. Das heißt, die ergänzen sich sozusagen, die beiden Adders? Ja, und ähm, nicht nur die. Also wir haben auch einzelne Strophen aus der Lieder Edda, die wieder in Sagatexten aufgenommen werden. Und so haben wir ganz, ganz... Wir interpretieren würden, zum Beispiel in Ibuka bei Lund. Auftrag war das erleitet, das Wikinger Museum Heiterburg in Duster und Schleswig-Holstein und hat uns viel erzählt über die Sitten und... Hello everyone, I'm so so sorry for not posting, but I've got my finals coming up, I just moved, um, I, as you know, started like three months ago my new job, so I want to perform, so I was overwhelmed and um, I didn't feel like, um, I don't know, putting myself out there. Uh, but yeah, I'm back now. I'm, I finally moved to my university town. Man, it's hot. And um, yeah, as you, as you will see in some of the, the clips, like I already f like furnished my, um, my apartment and I'm super, super happy. I love the city. I love studying here. Um, but yeah, it's an adjustment. I gotta get used to it because I'm far away from people I know and I really don't know anyone here. <laughs> so it will definitely be challenging because um, being a 30 something year old woman, like I'm not that I'm not flexible meeting people, but um, you're kind of you know what you want and you're not like you you're not wasting as much time anymore um which is good on the one hand on the other hand yeah you meet less people or you're you you judge before even trying kind of um because you have a lot of experience a lot more of experience well and now I rambled a little bit. This um, video will be just like a few clips of like living here and studying. Um, I try to consider everyone's like privacy when I'm in the library. Um, when there are no finals, the library is empty and it's nice to film there. But right now it's packed. So um, I don't want to film myself studying there and um, yeah, like um, disturbing other other students. So today's a beautiful day. The sun is out. Well, the second I said it, it got a little bit gloomy, I feel like, but um, it's a nice day and it's pretty warm. I feel like, I don't know, it feels like spring. It's not like really February. <laughs> um, it's like... 13, 14 degrees, like Celsius. So yeah, I just got ready. I went to, like I, I worked out and I try to work out every morning, um, but I don't like filming myself working out. I think it's like such a, such a hype. I mean, it's part of my life, but it's not worth filming it. You know, like I don't film myself brushing my teeth or going to the toilet or whatever like i feel like it's something um that everyone should um integrate in in their life and there are definitely times where i i like doing that but i walk a lot and i try to like you know balance it out if i don't work out as much i i walk even more um so yeah um that's it from me. <laughs> so I'm just gonna, um, um, yeah, show a few snippets 
here and there of the city, of me moving here, of me studying, and I hope you enjoy it, like, just aesthetically, kind of. Um, and, yeah, I feel like I'm... I'm in a fairy tale, Harry Potter inspired town kind of. Um, I really, really love it. And I love my apartment. I feel really comfortable here. And so these are all positive things. And well, we'll see how it goes. So I, because I missed out on all my like presents class hours it's a little bit harder to study right now because i just have like the powerpoint presentations and i try to make sense out of them and um today saturday on tuesday i'm writing my finals <sighs> and i'm excited well if i don't pass i will have to have to study again and go the whole way again but for now, I'm just going to do whatever I can. So that's me rambling for five and a half minutes. Uh, yeah. Have fun. <laughs>lucky enough that my professor texted me one hour after um, I put in my finals and he was kind enough to let me know that I passed and I passed with a good grade um, and yeah I'm super super happy yesterday I celebrated a little bit um, with some people from, from university from 
um, the philosophy major. And um, today is Valentine's Day. And I'm gonna take myself out on a date. Um, I think I'm just gonna go and eat somewhere. Um, and I'm a little bit tired from yesterday because we had a, a little bit of wine. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm gonna take myself out on a date and then I'm gonna finally upload this random little um, video that I was promising all of you for two, three weeks now, maybe. Uh, I was really bad in uploading, but now back on track, back on track. So yeah, I think I'm gonna take myself on a date and that's basically it. I don't know if I'm gonna film anything. Um, sorry about the noise, like there's construction. And uh, yeah, I think you still liked it, even though it's a little bit random and there's not too much to see, but um, I can definitely also talk, if you're interested, I can definitely talk about uh, my finals, what I had to learn, like what kind of things I had to learn and um, what, uh, yeah, what we actually, what kind of tasks we got on, on the finals. And yeah, the next video, I mean, I'm gonna take you along definitely. Um, uh, on my paper, my, I'm studying and researching for my paper, and how I will choose my next classes for next semester because that's coming up as well. And yeah, that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you'll stick around. And I think, yeah, I'm so I'm so grateful for each of each of you who um, you know are following me and um, are interested in philosophy and in studying at a different, not common age maybe. Um, yeah, thank you so much. Now I'm rambling. Bye-bye. See you next week.